During my freshman year of college, I got an epiphany and decided to do something different. I decided to study abroad. I'm a Clemson nursing major of the class of 2011, but I had a lot of time on my hands, so I decided to work on getting a business minor. Luckily for me, Clemson University was starting a new program in Brussels, Belgium for business minors. Before leaving, I was given a Belgium survival kit by some of my close friends. I recommend this for anyone going abroad. For the spring of 2009, I was one of the 17 students that pioneered Clemson's CUBC Fast Track to Business Study Abroad program. Our group became pretty close on the trip. I especially came to love the girls that I lived with. Allison was my roommate. She's the artsy one. Stacy lived in the apartment above us. We could always count on her to provide comic relief. Laura lived upstairs as well. She's our little world traveler. The four of us did a lot together, from school to traveling to just hanging out. When we all first arrived in Brussels, we thought it was really amazing. We toured the city and awed at the architecture and how different everything was. Personally, I really liked the graffiti all over the city. Our first trip away from Belgium was to Ireland. We flew into Dublin using Ryanair, the cheap flight airline that goes all around Europe. I absolutely loved Ireland. I could have listened to Irish accents forever. We visited Dublin, Cork, Killarney, and Galway. The scenery was magnificent. You could feel the cleanliness of the air. The cliffs of Moher near Galway were a must-see. They were absolutely breathtaking. Pictures just do not do them justice. I was able to take my second trip out of Belgium when one of my best friends, Summer, came to visit for her spring break. We visited London and Paris together. It was really weird to have people speaking English all around us in London. I kept finding myself throwing out common French phrases such as pardon and merci without even thinking about it. Paris was a beautiful city. It was interesting to watch my friend explore the concept of being in a foreign country since I was already so used to the experience. After Paris, I was in Belgium for quite some time, doing the school thing and living it up in the city. We threw a day trip to Luxembourg and amongst our studies. The trip consisted mostly of walking lonely roads dotted with windmills. We did, however, get to see a castle. Eventually, we made it to our Easter break. We spent it in Sardinia, an island off the coast of Italy. Although we had some icky weather in the beginning, we ended up having some beautiful sunshine and blue skies to match the gorgeous blue Mediterranean Sea. The sunset on the beach was amazing. The next weekend, we traveled to Italy yet again. Italy was easily my favorite country. This time we visited Rome and Venice. Rome especially had beautiful architecture. Venice was a cute little place. We took full advantage of their gelato. After this one last trip, we had finals week and the end of our semester abroad. There were definitely mixed feelings as we said our goodbyes to come back to the States. On my trip abroad, I discovered new friends, tried new things, stepped outside my comfort zone, made new inside jokes, got lost a lot, and basically lived on the edge. And after it all, I came out with unforgettable memories. unforgettable friends.